what happens if you're having sex with women? Yeah. You become feminine. <laughs> yes. I don't think Jason Statham's <laughs> ever had sex with a woman. The Rock definitely hasn't. Sex is not very sexy. Yeah. And it's not very masculine. It's not very masculine at all. <laughs> it's kind of a lady Imagine. thing to do. <laughs> <laughs> oh, yeah, I want, I want to lay around in the sheets. Who wants to lay around in sheets? <laughs> men should, men getting, should hate sheets. <laughs> men should like... You should, be out, you should be out getting money. Or like on a yacht. You should be out literally like at the gym. Working on your body in an ice bath. I don't even think so. I think you should be like getting a car and kind of restoring it in your garage (laughs) and drinking a beer and having a cigarette and listening to Leonard Skinner. Yeah. And that doesn't mean... Yeah, and then you go to bed and go, shit. (laughs) Because you don't even want to be in the... You don't even like sleeping. Men shouldn't like sleeping. You shouldn't want to sleep. It's a feminine thing. Imagine being like... I'm going to close my, my little eyes now. <laughs> I'm going to curl me, up. Me, 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 Get me. comfortable. <laughs> <laughs> Men shouldn't be getting comfortable. No. Men should be probably like maybe sitting on like a hard <laughs> surface with one eye open. Yeah. It's like major pain thing. <laughs> yeah. I don't know if you watched that movie, Major Pain. No, I haven't. But he didn't sleep. It was like a, this, it was like a comedy movie, but yeah. um, Damon Wayne's didn't sleep. And that was one of his crazy things. He would snore, but he would never sleep. He was always awake. And I think a kid tried to steal something from him and he literally just like grabbed him. You should yeah. always be ready as a man. Men should, yeah, they should sleep standing up. Yeah. At the front of their house on their porch, <laughs> holding a shotgun. <laughs> Imagine that. Imagine you're like a kid, like a, a guy or a girl. Yeah. Um, you're like, dang, I've got a, like an alpha. Mm. My dad's an alpha. Yeah. That's a, what you're going to think. Imagine you're like an eight-year-old boy. You hear like, me, 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 going, coming in from upstairs. Yeah, you, know, you like lose some, all respect yeah. for your dad. <laughs> Imagine like sh- having to shake your dad to wake up. And you're like, oh, what? Yeah. You want to go up to your dad and be like, why aren't you in bed? Yeah, it's literally like, dad, I don't want to do my chores. Yeah. It's like, you think I want to do chores? And it's like, yeah. dad, I don't want to get a job. Yeah. It's like, you think I want to have a job? <laughs> Yeah. Dad, I don't want to go to sleep. Does that work? Wait a sec, okay. I think it works. Let's go. I think dad, I don't want to go to sleep. And the dad says, you want? You think I want to go to sleep? <laughs> oh, dang. <laughs> it kind of worked. Kind of worked. Yeah, there's something good there. Uh, but having sex is definitely a feminine thing to do. Yes. A very feminine thing. Well, I'm so masculine. Yes. There we go. Back to back. That's good. That's a good feeling. <laughs> No, but it's the truth. It's literally the truth. Um, yeah. We got we to stop that. We really need to stop that. Men need to stop chasing women. Men need to... What do they do? What no, do but I th- also think you should probably have sex. No, you can't. It's a crazy thing to do. Yeah. You're vulnerable. Right. You've always got to be ready. Actually, yeah. You've always got to be... It's like a dog um, urinating or, or dropping a doo-doo. It hates it because it's at its most vulnerable Ooh, right now. You shouldn't be in a position where someone could... 100%. You should be... You always got to be ready. You should be what? But you're not sleeping, so you're not going to like yes, bust you won't a sleep. nut during your sleep. No, you're, you're not, not going to have, have a, wet dreams. Literally, you're, gonna you're awake. Wet dreams. But you're going to get like sick. So you probably... You need probably, to bust somehow. No, what happens? You're not going to get sick because you're, you're going to be arrested. You don't need to bust. That's what... That's for women... If you want to relax and like sit around and listen to listen to Drake, then you go busting. Yeah. You want to be like on edge. If you haven't busted, you're really on edge. You yeah. you literally think about your whereabouts. Yeah. Because your body is like, "Hey dude, you're meant to be releasing this seed, why aren't you? You got to find a partner right now." Mm. And you use that energy to find a partner to get better. Yeah. And like literally be ready to defend yourself against your enemies. If you don't have enemies, you're not a man. Yeah, okay. Like, yeah. I don't have any enemies. I really, I, I feel quite feminine. Uh, yeah. That I know of. I need to start developing some enemies. I think in order to be like an actual man, you need to have some enemies. Like, but what does an enemy kind of look like? Like, this is like a mutual vendetta. It's a dude that wants to kill you. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> and you got to want to kill a few dudes. Yeah, yeah. That's just your state of being. It's like, I'm probably going to kill this dude soon. Mm. That's the 
ultimate like male thing. Wouldn't it suck if you had an enemy and they didn't consider you an enemy? <laughs> Yeah, like I really so hate. Like you're not, a, you're not even a threat. You've probably had sex <laughs> this week. If you've literally got people out there, other men that want to murder you, do you think you're going to be having the luxury of having sex? That's the yeah. one time that you know they're going to kill you. <laughs> literally, yeah. Are you going to be like, oh yeah, oh, that's such a feminine action. Having yeah, having sex. You get lost in the moment, even at all. You're trying to do something. You just got to be ready on your porch with a gun. Because you know what, um, yeah, you know what a lot of people do when they have sex. Yeah, they kiss. They do kiss. That's crazy. Kissing. A man, is, <laughs> a man kissing. doesn't kiss. Imagine a man going like. You know what a man does? They yeah. give you a firm handshake. <laughs> This is literally maybe the answer. You should only do it when absolutely necessary. Having sex. Yeah. There's no, there's never a time you need to ever have sex. When? Possibly. Children. You got to have children. Oh, you do have to have children. I think you should um, maybe jerk off and yeah. artificially inseminate. Have literally, <laughs> literally jerk off with a gun in your other hand. <laughs> <laughs> and then so bust. like normal. You got to jerk <laughs> off like normal. You should jerk off, have a gun in one hand, yep. and then like it, have your have your essence, have your seed go over like a plate, and then give it to someone to be like, put that in her. <laughs> yeah, we're having a son. Yeah, that's how it should be. Yes, you, because you're not having sex; it's just not happening. Hmm. You're inside a woman. That's when your enemies get you the most. <laughs> yeah, yeah. You can't be anywhere near your wife. She needs to be protected in like another room because that's that's also who your enemies are going after. It's like they can't get to you; they can't get to my wife. Yeah. You should have your wife and kids locked away in like some secure like home. And also, this is like a Batman thing. Like, if you get too close to them, yes, yes. So you, oh. it's probably best you don't love them. Because <laughs> in all honesty, your enemies are pretty good. They're probably going to kill your wife at some point. Yeah. They're probably going to kill one of your and if, kids. if your enemies are not equipped to kill your wife, they're probably not a very powerful enemy. <laughs> I wouldn't have... Yeah, because I want the most powerful, powerful enemies. <laughs> because that means you're a powerful man. If you have enemies <laughs> yeah. that have probably killed one of your kids, you're probably on your third wife. Imagine how much of an you are. You're still... <laughs> You're still alive. They've killed two of my wives, three of my kids. I'm a badass. I'm a real badass. That's that's kind of the equilibrium, <laughs> isn't it? Like, you almost want them to have done that. Yeah. Yeah, literally. Yeah. It's, like a, it's like a sign of, like, pride. As soon as yeah. your first wife has been murdered, yeah. you're like, okay, well, I guess I must be doing the right thing. Yeah. I'm on the, I'm on the right path. Yeah, and then your wife... It's not ideal... Yeah. I mean, not ideal. Yeah. But it's probably going to... Ha- also, you admire your enemy. No, this You're is like, what you should be doing. You bastard. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. That's what you want to say. You bastard. You got me. You got yeah. my queen. <laughs> yeah. yeah. Luckily, I can get a new one because I wasn't emotionally attached because I'm an <laughs> alpha. But you got my queen. You bastard. I'm coming after you and I'm going to come after your wife or kids or anyone. Yeah. It is crazy that like Andrew Tate and that is saying all this stuff. Yeah. He's obsessed with women too much. He's not thinking about... he. Do you know what? Let's just put this out here. Andrew Tate doesn't have serious enemies. What? Yeah. Really? He doesn't have serious enemies. I suppose he doesn't. Like, he's got what? Like, Russia, Russian prisons. Um, which yeah, isn't that serious of an enemy. Has he had any wives killed? Maybe. Maybe. Mm. He does talk about how he has people that want to kill him, which is yeah. a really good sign of, like, an alpha. Having... Yeah. Um, But he's talking about women and... Um, but maybe not too much. Actually, Imagine. no, he's probably close to being a pretty alpha dude. He might be the most alpha man in existence. Think about, like, literally us just walking around and we have no need to look over our shoulder. Yes. Such a feminine thing. Where, yeah. And Why, I, yeah. I wish that it wasn't that way, but it is. Yeah. Honestly, I go outside and I'm pretty relaxed. I feel safe. I'm pretty relaxed. I'm pretty that relaxed. That shouldn't be the case. Mm. We should go outside and literally... Yeah. We shouldn't even go outside, probably. Have you seen Lil Dirk? No. Yeah. 
It's how he looks. He's got them thangs on him. He's got them thangs on him. If your <laughs> eyes aren't like, compl- you can completely see your eyeball. Yeah. There's not enough going on in your life. What what's up with Dirk? Is he? He's got enemies. He's, he's got literally... so many people that want to. People around him are getting killed. Yes, you have to be looking like little Dirk. That's how you also know you're around like an alpha male. If a dude looks at you like this and doesn't really blink, have you been around like personal trainers? Mm. A really good personal trainer doesn't blink. Right. I don't know why. I think I'm slowly starting to wrap my head around it as I get older. Yeah. What's the reason? But I think they're alphas. Yeah. I think it's an alpha sign. Blinking and stuff like that is like milliseconds that you, your it's, enemy it, could no, literally take like, you out. It's like Sleep Junior. Yeah, it's literally Sleep Junior. And yeah, it's like feminism for children. Yeah. Yeah. Maybe it's, I'm trying to think about like... It's for little know, girls. Yeah, blinking. Blinking is for little blinking girls. Blinking is for little girls. Yeah. Men should be keeping their eyes open and be on the lookout. I remember yeah. I had a friend who um, was from like America... And we went out, like, walking or something after, like, clubbing. And he would literally, like, he would do this all the time. Yes. And I think I, like, I, I said, what's, what are you, what are you, what is it you looking for something? He's like, oh, I'm just, this is just, like, a bad habit I got into. Yeah. Because, like, where I grew up, you have to kind of be on the lookout all the time. Tourette's is masculine. 